Hey, 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 everyone. We have right here another brand new model. I've been able to show y'all all, all types of brand new models from different manufacturers. And this one right here is nothing short of that. This is a home by a uh, champion. Okay, so let me tell you what's going on right here. I'm at a, at a plant show for you guys over here in Mansfield, Texas, okay? They're, they got a bunch of new models they are showing their retailers. These are all part of like, I guess you would say under kind of the champion umbrella, but they're at a different plants. This one's built out of Burleson, Texas. This one's built in Athens, Texas. And this is gonna be kind of like their highest end here. And that's the one we're touring today. I'm gonna try to get y'all some drone shots. We've got a metal roof. Side door right here is kind of why I wanted to start right here. But then let me, there's a generator on the other end. It's real loud, so I don't want to really have to go down there, but I want to give you a shot of the back side. And I want to stand in this shade right here for a minute. Let's get a good look. <laughs> oh man, I love the siding that they go with on these houses here. I just see that a lot here in Texas for sure. A lot more than I see at home. He's back around this way. We've got an electrical outlet there. Yeah, and then this one right here is Navasota, I believe. Navasota, Texas. We got a little bit of a porch on this one. Now this floor plan is really cool. Y'all definitely gonna wanna see this one. This floor plan is one, you know, it's just out of the ordinary. It's something we don't get to tour every day, that's for sure. Now I know that, like I said, generators in here, but I'm gonna be real brief. I just gotta give you this look, look at this. We even have some single section homes over there. We'll be getting some of them as well. Now, since it's almost 150 degrees out here, I'm gonna go ahead and step inside. I think they got the AC going. Let's step up on this porch. Yep. Yep. Now, I've seen some of these uh, porches like this they have where they have their railing, like this rebar. It looks very good. I like the black that they went with on everything. And if you notice back out here, notice like our fascia and everything is black, all that soffit and every, everything. And then you got these light, this light wood color for us to trim around your windows. So this exterior just really pops, really caught my attention. Plug there, beautiful light fixture at the front door. And that's where we going. Y'all don't forget to drop a like, please subscribe if you will. And also share this video, share, share, share. Here we go. Side. Oh, I noticed we got us a vaulted ceiling right here. We'll get a closer look at that. Come on down this way. Maybe I should just give, okay, that's enough, that's enough. <laughs> There's a lot to see in there. We're gonna see every bit of it. Here's something cool for y'all as well. Let me give you a good shot of this. You can screenshot, see we got some different options right here. We got a four bed and a three bedroom. And yeah, these are built out of Athens, Texas. So I'm very honored to be able to tour these homes and show them to y'all. The marketing team at Champion, huge shout out to them for them helping me find out about this and making this happen. Uh, being able to tour these houses to put here and show y'all, you know, so like they set these up for the retailers. They're trying to get orders, you know, that sort of thing. But they let me video them to be able to post them on here so y'all get to see some brand new, just coming out, just released, just dropped, just landed, uh, what's a, uh, fresh on the market. I'm always trying to come up with little sayings, but yeah. Just making an appearance, I like this. I like this, this is a tile that we have around your electric fireplace, and I noticed this shiplap here is like darker, and then you have this little bit lighter trim and this is gonna be the same as these beams. Oh, 
Okay. I've shown y'all the vaulted ceiling enough, I feel like. Like, all right, man, we've seen the ceiling. The camera just keeps wanting to go that way. I can't do nothing. So let's say you can see on the floor plan, they don't really have this mapped out, but right here they put some tables, you know, maybe like a dining spot. But then you also, you'll see you have this little area in the kitchen, which is what we're finna get to here in just a second. Notice our coat racks right here by the door. Farmhouse, farmhouse-ish. Uh, okay, okay. All right, here's a look at that kitchen. And this is where we're gonna go into next. Now, I love this right here going into your kitchen. I mean, this is a big space, y'all. can y'all tell? You got a lot of room. It's not like a little tight cramp spot coming into your kitchen. And yeah, we got the nook over there. We got bar stools. Let's start going this way. Whirlpool appliances. Uh-huh. Okay, so look at all this. Look at all this. We've got black cabinets on our bottom. When I say our bottom. It goes black up over there. We've got white over here with the black pools. White tops right here. But then we've got a black top right here. And this is... Stone Chris done did it. <laughs> Man, it's like I mentioned that in one video and I see that everywhere now, Stone Chris. All right, here's where the dishwasher's located. We've got the big farm sink with the Springer faucet. What you got, y'all know the deal. You can pull that out, spray around, whatever, spray the kids. Hey, eat your food. Eat, boy. Are you finna? <laughs> That's what I be having to do to color. He don't want to eat, he wants to play too much. That's why I need one of these. Like, what? I remember seeing these when I did those homes in Dresden, which is also a champion plant. Obviously it's a different plant, but I remember seeing those. All right, I'm glad I walked around here. See, we've got some cabinets here on this end. Somebody commented other day said, you always open top cabinets, you ever never open any bottom cabinets. Here you go. Now this is just here to keep the show model cool, obviously, but if you think about it, if that wasn't there, you got a lot of walk around space right here to go to this area right here. Let's step over there next. Before we do though, let me make sure you guys do see that we have a built-in microwave and I will open a top cabinet too. You notice our vaulted ceilings continue in here as well. And this looks like this might be a pantry. Ooh. Now we're gonna hold off on the pantry dance on this because, wait a minute. Should we? It's bo I mean, it's borderline, what do y'all? But then there's that, y'all are gonna be, <laughs> y'all gonna be watching. I gotta turn. <laughs> Just, just a little bit of one, just a little bit of one. Cause it is technically walk in. You got these very nice shelves. It deserved it. All right. So we've got this sliding door right here. If we slide that back this way, it's going to go into your laundry room. And this is where the side door was that I was showing y'all kind of when we first started the video out there. We've got a breaker box. We've got some hangers right here. Looks like a dog leash. Is this a cat leash? Do you put leashes on cats? I don't, I don't know if that's a good idea. I'm not really a cat person, so I don't know much about them. Spot for your washer and the dryer. 
We've got this uh, here. I love to see this hanging rod. Plus we have a nice shelf as well. Okay, two bedrooms. I'll tell you what, let's go in this one first. Ah, we got carpet in here. Overhead vents. I'm liking to see that. We've got these same hanging rods in here that we see in the laundry room. In between these two bedrooms, we have us a nice, comfortable guest bathroom. Let's walk in here and check it out. Like they got us a cabinet right here over the commode. And it has these shelves right here that you can adjust, you know, put them Look, I'm not even like, like, I, like I'm messing it up. Look at me. Look at me. I'm just terrible. There we go. <laughs> it's hard to do this stuff with one hand. Shaver Tough Combo in here, matte, same matte black faucets that's on our sink. I would imagine the uh, main bath will be the same way. All right, let's head down here to the main bedrooms where we're gonna finish things up in this farmhouse-ish, farmhouse-ish home. Into the main bedroom, we will step. All right, let's take a look at this. I like this, we kind of like a little decor right here. You can see a lot of the different options. And I'm not gonna spend too much time, but if you wanna pause screenshot, you can see your cabinet doors, countertops, that's gonna be uh, that's gonna be what was on the uh, kitchen island. All right, into the main bedroom closet right here. Let's see if we can get this light on. One thing I've always really loved about the Champion Homes, even notice this like at other plants like the Dresden one, I love their interior doors. I love that design. This and then like a five panel is probably my two favorites. What about y'all? It's the first time I've seen it, but y'all drop a comment. I wanna know what y'all think about this house. We got the sliding door into the bath and that's where we're headed. Here we go. I wanna start out right here and show y'all this first. Now we don't have any sinks in it. I'm just kidding. We've got some sinks, look, look right there behind me. But I had to show you this first. I like this area. Got the black tops in here as well. And this is gonna be a different top than what was on the kitchen island. Of course, we've got sinks. We've got two of them over here. Plus we got a little countertop space. We got this same backsplash. This trim was in the bath, in the guest bath, and it's also over there. Oh my gosh, we've got another closet. We've got another closet and we've got a huge shower Whew. 
Y'all stick around, we'll get into a lot of information on this house right after the tour. Yeah, two closets, man. I'm big, I'm a big fan of that. Big, big fan of that. And then we're gonna wrap things up right here with this shower. Now, first thing I'm noticing, we've gotta get a close up, is look at this. I just love that. You got that there, and then we have this darker tile with this, you know, this white, uh, maybe like a, what would you call that? Kind of like an off-white, maybe eggshell. Let me get you a good shot of here. Uh, grout. So when you're standing back, it's just that, that those colors together really pop. Yeah, we've got the matte black faucets in here as well. Oh, and I love that. They took this and they put it right here on top of your uh, bench area. So we don't have like the fiberglass. We've got that. That's, that's a huge bonus, I think. You got the nice cut glass here as well. Plus we have us a window. I've got that same same material there as well. Let me let me step back. I'm sure there's an option for a tub. Y'all keep that in mind, but this is the show model. You know, they went all out with this crazy big shower. So we're finna get into the nitty gritty, the stuff I know y'all wanna know. Before we do that, y'all please share this video. Can't ask you that enough. Please subscribe and don't forget to drop a like. Thank you. So a brand new model, a little over 1,500 square foot and manufactured by Champion Home Builders. And this, like, once again, I'll mention this is at their Athens, Texas plant is where this one is manufactured. Um, I really love the floor plan. And then I was just looking at it again. Basically, yes, you do have options for that tub in that uh, main bathroom if you would like to option that in. Information will be in the description. As always, we'll have our website link. That's the fastest, easiest way to get in contact. Uh, see about getting finance and pre-approvals on this home or any home on the channel. We have our members area link where we take a deeper dive and people that's in there knew I been to this place like mm, probably three weeks ago. You just kind of get exclusive looks at stuff and we really uh, hop behind the computer and check out things. So check that out. Um, also, second channel links in the description. Videos come out Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday night. Ain't even gotta say it. Ain't even got to say I'm going to. Next video is Thursday night, 645 Central. Let's get into some estimated retail pricing. Now, this is a house like I've done in several, like I've done here a good bit in the past. This is at a plant. It's not at a dealership, so we don't know a lot of our freight charges. We don't know the, the county, the state fees and stuff that we're going to have associated with this house. And depending on the options that you go with on this particular home. If you notice those kitchen countertops, uh, I really like them. They're kind of a something. I don't know how long they've been doing them. I think it's fairly new. So with that being said, that top's really not that much more expensive than just your regular like Formica. But I will say anything, anything that you option in, option out is going to have an impact on price. So keep all that in mind. This will be just a range for at the time of recording right here. There you go. Hey, I hope all of you have a wonderful 4th of July. Um, I know that's the day this video is actually coming out. I uh, hope y'all have a, have a great time with your family. So thankful for the country we live in. I'm a huge fan of this country. So grateful to be able to live here and just very thankful. Very, very thankful. I hope y'all are as well. I'll see you Thursday night. God bless you all. See you.